What's up YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. I'm back again with my Vitamix Exploring Series E310. And this is like a basic Vitamix model. In fact, for 2021, I think we're going to upgrade. But of course, I could keep this model and it'll probably last me 30, 40 years, I'm sure. But y'all know how I do. Anywho, prior to my, this is my first Vitamix guys. And prior to this, I had Ninja Blenders, which nothing's wrong with them. They're great machines, but a Vitamix is a Vitamix. But anywho, I just realized I have not made a frap in my Vitamix. And that must change the day. So guys, I'm going to make a pumpkin spice frap. Better yet, a low carb pumpkin spice frap. Whipped cream does not have any carbs. This is just coffee. We're not putting any cream in it. Although it's pumpkin spice, I imagine it shouldn't have too many. This doesn't have any carbs. This doesn't have any carbs. I was surprised to find this at Walmart. Can you see it? I guess you can. I got this at Walmart. This is cool. I was looking for something like this uh, um, at on Amazon, and I did see some, but they were very expensive. Got this at Walmart, too. Look at that, guys. Four net carbs. Cool beans. Special help from my hot and cold brewing system by Ninja. It does T2, y'all. I'll put a link in the description. This is If you don't have this machine, you, you need it in your life. I promise. And by the way, guys, I mostly drink teas out of this machine because this brews tea as well. I put This is Moringa leaves. You can look it up. It's very good for you. My mom has a Moringa tree in her backyard, and she um, gathers the leaves, crush, um, lets them dry, and crushes them. And this is what I get. It's very, very, very good for you. But anywho, all right, let's get my paper filter in here. Now, it comes with a plastic one with the machine, but I like to use paper filters because I could just throw it out after. I just opened up the Starbucks Limited Edition Pumpkin Spice. You smell it first. You got it? All right. I don't make coffee much, guys. I don't forget how much coffee I'm supposed to put in here. And I'm going to put two scoops. That should be good. We're just going to make like... You know, like a half a cup worth. Of course, this machine is single cup, but it does come with a carafe that I've never used in life. <laughs> so, let me put my mug here. Y'all like that? You see that? You see that? But you know what? I'm, I'm going to use my Cooking with Doug mug. I'm going to use my Booger 500 US mug. Shout out to Booger 500 US one time. All right, let's just get this going. All right, yep, I'm going to leave it at rich. I'm going to leave it at that. See, I have different things I could do. But this one, let me go ahead and hit start. Now, I forgot to tell you guys, the, um, the pumpkin spice Starbucks, I smell pumpkin in it, but it's not like super, super strong as far as the smell. I smell more like just like black coffee smell than pumpkin, but... That doesn't mean that a brew might not. A brew might be good. So we'll see. I smell a little pumpkin. But I smell a deep, strong black coffee. Which I, you know, guys, when I drink coffee, I just drink it black with like a little touch of milk to just change it to the color and that's it. I don't put no sugar in it. I drink coffee because I'm tired. That's the only reason why. <laughs> so that's what, five cups a year probably or less. Set timer for 20 minutes. 20 minutes, starting now. Like you heard, I'm gonna put this in my freezer for 20 minutes. Just, I want it to be totally cool, um, preferably even cold. Shout out to all my subscribers that drink a cup or two or three or four or five uh, cups of coffee every day. And shout out to Karen one time in my groups. I know she has one every morning. I'm going to give you a quick fun fact about me. I have about five or less cups of coffee per year, but my favorite ice cream flavor is coffee. <laughs> yep, I know, weird. All right, guys, I got about one minute left, so... I got a cup of ice out. 
I'm going to put this back in the freezer, but from this point, it's going to go fast. All right, I'm just going to pour my coffee right in there. We're going to put four cups of this. This is just plain vanilla, guys. You can use whatever ice cream you want, by the way. You don't have to use this Briars, or you can use whatever you want. All right, got my four cups. All right, so I'm going to put my pumpkin syrup in there. Like I said, I got this at Walmart. I'm just going to count to four. One, two, three, four. This syrup is light. It's a light syrup. I guess that's why it's low carb. Two tablespoons of this. Of course, I'm not going to measure. I'm just going to dump. That's one. That's two. <laughs> this ice cream in there. Try not to make a big glob. There we go. Get in there. Finally, one cup of ice right on the top. All right, let's go. That easy, guys. Gotta leave space for some whipped cream. All right. And just for decoration, I suppose. Alright guys, I just did my thumbnail so we're good. So let's take a look at it. Looking really good. You take the first sip. You got it? Alright. Mm-hmm. This is good. Very good. Mm -hmm. That's really good, guys. But this is certainly cool. Nothing says fall other than pumpkin spice, right? So there you go. That's my pumpkin spice video. I hope you guys like it. I'll leave everything I did in the description so you follow it. But this was simple and easy. We use ice cream. And in my case, I use low carb. So if you know anyone with blood sugar problems, don't leave them out. They can enjoy a nice pumpkin spice frap just as well. Oh, and I'll leave a link in the description to my low carb nation group. Lower carb nation. It's no keto, but it's just lower carb. I'll come in there if you are um, on a low carb diet. But again, this is for everybody. You don't have to use low carb syrup or low carb ice cream. You use regular ice cream. It's, it's all good. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. If anything, thanks for just even looking at my video, y'all. It's Cooking with Doug, and we out.